Hi, welcome back to our channel. My name's Alice and today we're going to answer a question we get asked a lot. Can I prevent dementia? A risk factor is something that affects our chances of developing a condition like dementia. For most of us, our risk of dementia is made up of our age, environment, lifestyle, health and our genes. Some of these risk factors, like our age and genes, we can't change. Because of this, there are no surefire ways of preventing dementia, but 45 in 100 cases of dementia worldwide are linked to 14 factors we do have some control over. And this means we can reduce our risk of developing dementia by addressing certain risk factors. It's good for our heart, it's good for our brain, so there are steps we can take to reduce our dementia risk. These include eating a healthy balanced diet, staying physically active, only drinking alcohol within the recommended limits, quitting smoking and managing long-term health conditions like diabetes, high blood pressure and high cholesterol. Having a visual or hearing impairment also contributes to an increased dementia risk. So it's important to get your eyes and hearing checked regularly. The good news is that using hearing aids may reduce the risk of dementia linked to hearing loss by around 20%. Staying connected with people and avoiding social isolation is also important for our brain health and reduces our dementia risk. Also doing things we enjoy that challenge our brains and keep our minds active, like reading, learning or doing puzzles, all help to reduce our dementia risk. Some other factors that can increase our dementia risk are harder for us to control, but it's still important for us to be aware of them. Exposure to high levels of air pollution and having a lower early years education level can increase our risk of dementia. Most of these risk factors start to increase our likelihood of getting dementia in our 40s, 50s and 60s. However, being exposed to a few factors in our early and later life also affects our risk. So it's never too early or too late to start thinking about our brain health and taking steps to improve it. You can find out more about the things you can do to look after your brain health by completing the Think Brain Health check-in. This is a quiz that's designed to help you explore your brain healthy behaviours and give you some simple tips on how you can give your brain some love. We'll also pop a link below where you can read more information about all of the risk factors that I've discussed in this video. If you have any further questions, then please drop us a comment below. And if you like this video, we'll think you'll also like this one. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.